Okay, we got out of the heat over at the car show and figured we'd come over to Steve Darnell's shop, Welder Up. Come to find out, we didn't realize that we got here, eh, I guess an hour early, but the door was wide open and we came in and we just ran into somebody and took our uh, $5 for admission and said, enjoy yourself. So we're not gonna have any crowds. I'm just gonna film some of these rat rods he built with the nice, uh, Music in the background. The salt flat car. And his welding truck would love to have a bench like that at work. Actually did pretty good on the suspension on this truck. You could probably flex a little bit. And over here we have Evil Knievel Formula One Dragster. Funny little motorcycle. I'm not sure what that is, but it definitely looks old school. I know this Evil Knievel Dragster was definitely a wheelie machine. Always lifting the front end up. And you definitely wouldn't want someone to pull up in this thing and tell you they've got some candy. There's a ride for you. I don't know, Annalise, if you could fit Yep, these would definitely not be comfortable to ride in, especially in the Vegas heat. The seats don't look comfortable and you know they are hot. So many cool, old, rusty, dirty things that are just 
to me, totally awesome. Love this stuff. I think my yard would look like this and the HOA would definitely have a fit. Right, Sandy? My yard would look like this and the HOA would have a fit. Have the coolest yard. As long as your tetanus shots are up to date, you can come over. So many details. A lot of them are. A lot of them, yeah, they'll sell them. Make some money, build some new ones. Yeah, this looks like uh, Knott's Berry Farm and the country section of Disneyland. Except, you can't see it without being in person. This is so much better. I'm not even catching half of this. guy back there working. Get you. And you can't, I don't know if you can see it on the wall, look at all those seats. Without the upholstery on them. So many cool little signs in here. If you're ever in Vegas, you gotta come here in person. It's only $5 each. Come in. It's uh, got a swamp cooler going, so it's definitely cooler. And there's so much more to see that you just, you, you, you could spend an hour just looking at the non-car items that are here. So much history in it, it's unbelievable. Definitely come down here if you're in Vegas. It's a cool place. <laughs>